So, this is percents in math on chapter 4.1. By Nathan and Lex. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to do percents. Um, if you have, like, 100% of something, 100% of, like, 30, it definitely equals, oh, don't mind that line, um, 30. <laughs> Because a hundred percent of thirty is thirty. So, if you want to bring it down, like to if it's ten percent of thirty, what you're gonna do is you're gonna take the zero off. So, ten percent. You take a zero off of a hundred. So you take the zero off of oops, off thirty, and you just like take it out. So, in the answer, it's just three. So ten percent of thirty. Equals three. Okay, so basically what oh never mind. <laughs> okay, so You didn't press okay. Yeah I did, I did. Okay. So don't don't Sorry. judge me, okay. I'm gonna write in this color because this color looks nicer. Um so Basically, uh, if you had to do the opposite, where like you have two hundred percent of, let's just use thirty again. You would have to double the number that you previously had. So in this instance, it's thirty. So thirty would be carried down to here. So it'd be thirty. So for a hundred percent, it would be the original number. So thirty equals a hundred percent. So you have to add 100% plus 100%. I'm decide to do that because it's a lot easier. So 30, this, 30, or if you want to just do it like this, 100% plus 100%. I already hate when our people speak when we're trying to do stuff. Yep. So that e that would equal 60, Which or for this it would just be 200%. Can you not say yep whenever I have a lightsaber? <laughs> okay, um, yeah, so that's... So now we're going to uh, show you uh, fra fractional percents. Um, so, 100% of 50 is 50, as you know already. So what that would also be would be 50 over 50. Which is also a hundred percent. Um, and if you change that fraction to half, so half tw half of fifty is twenty-five, and you put it over fifty, that would be fifty percent. That's not fifty-six. That's a fifty. That's a fifty. That looks like it invented zero. Um. Yeah, and if you doubled it to 100 over 50, that would be considered an improper fraction. So I'm just going to let Nathan do that. You just do it. Okay, so basically for an improper fraction, let's just use 100 for that. And 100, and let's just use the easiest number, 101. That would equal... Since this is over that, that kind of looks like lol, but it's not. Don't worry, it's not lol. It is actually 101, so that or top would be 101%. Now, if you saw it over like 50, and uh, 50.5, or 50. Point five, five zero point five equals one hundred and one percent because it's the same thing as that. It's just this is divided by two, and it you can also if I can just drag across this page. Oh, that actually does work. Okay, that's nice. Um, so you can also do something like. A hundred and twenty 
over 100. That would equal 120 percent. Okay, 120. Because I'm a best artist, uh, 120 percent. Congratulations. And that is what that is. That's an arrow. Okay, this this thing right here. Is, it's a lightsaber. Is, yep. So this is the end of our video. Sorry, but we are finishing now. Um, bye. Yeah, bye.